So you want to change the proofing language for your Microsoft Word document. In this document, we have two versions of the same sentence. One has US spelling and one has British spelling. Now, if I wanted to use the US language as the proofing language for my document, the first step would be to select the whole document. Now, you can either do that by manually selecting, just holding down your mouse and dragging over the content. Or if you have a very large document, you might want to use the shortcut key control A, which will select the whole document. Then you need to go to the review tab on your ribbon and then to the language button and then select set proofing language. Here you'll see the current proofing language that is being used. That's the one with the blue background. So we're going to swap it to English United States. And you need to make sure these two checkboxes are unticked. Click on OK. And now you can see it approves the US spelling, but not the British spelling. Now you can actually have more than one proofing language being used within a document, which can be quite confusing. What I could say is that although I want this sentence to be proofed with the US proofing language, I want this sentence to be proofed using the British proofing language. So if I select that sentence and go to language, set proofing language, what I can do here is select English United Kingdom for this particular sentence. And you can see now I have no spelling errors, despite the fact that I have different versions of the word colorful and humor. Now, a little tip for you, you can actually display the proofing language that is being used in any part of your document on the status bar down here. What I suggest you do is right click down here on the status bar and then select language. So that will show the language being used for the area of the document that you've selected. So here I can see English United Kingdom. But if I click up here, you can see it's using English United States. Now you can actually specify a default proofing language for your documents. To do that, go back to your language button, set proofing language, select the proofing language you want to set as the default and then set as default. It will say, do you want to change the default language to whatever you've selected? This change will affect all new documents based on the normal template. Now I'm gonna click on no. I've actually found this not to be a reliable way of setting your default language. Another way you can set the default proofing language is to go to language, language preferences. And here you can also select the default language for proofing. So for example, if I wanted English United States, I can select it and then click set as preferred. And then it will tell you that you have to restart Office for that effect to come into place. And again, I haven't found this a particularly reliable way of setting the default language. I'll just cancel out of that dialog box. So I think the main thing to remember is that if you want to set the proofing language, select the text before you try to do it. Now, normally you're gonna use the same proofing language throughout a document. So you would select the whole document, go up to language, set proofing language, and specify your language here. Okay. That's all I wanted to cover in this particular video. Hopefully that's useful. If it is, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe and I'll see you next video.